Summer 2016 has been a season of service, prayer, and tons of fun. As Jeff left for his sabbatical, we began reading through Ephesians, and we discovered that our true identity is in Christ. Several different speakers joined us as well, including Dr. Joel Gregory, Vody Bauckham, Timothy Atik, O.S. Hawkins, and Gabe Lyons. You can listen to any of their sermons on our PCBC app. Because something in you knows that there is more to being a father. And the only reason you know that is that God, by His grace, has granted you that desire. And He doesn't just grant desires. He satisfies them. All summer long, our awesome sports and recreation ministry offered summer fun camps for kids to have a blast and receive coaching in a ton of different sports. Our leaders presented the gospel and kids learned about honoring Jesus Christ on the field. We had 12 weeks of over 90 sessions of camps involving 990 families and 1,300 campers. Wow! VBS was a huge success with over 1,200 kids here at PCBC to go on a submarine adventure to learn about Jesus many of them hearing the gospel for the very first time. We had a faithful army of 275 teachers, 108 youth helpers, and our amazing staff who made sure every child knew that Jesus loves them. 12 third and fourth graders accepted Christ, and we met many new families. It was awesome. Our student camps had an impact on our kids from fifth to 12th grades through worship, Bible study, and friendship. We totaled 230 students at V Camp with three making decisions to follow Jesus and 12 decisions for baptisms. For our younger students, we also had messy camp. This was an exciting time for young students and we had over 60 participants. Three of them made decisions and it was a blast. Huge thanks goes out to all of the leaders and parents that helped out with our student camps this summer. While our summer has been fun, unfortunately our city was struck with tragedy and fear and we saw a great effort from people around our city and in our church, uniting to show support for our police officers. God had prepared us for such an occasion of racial tension and violence by making relationships through our pulpit swap with Concord Church. So many showed up and showed out at Together We Stand to truly pray and serve our city during such a tragic time. You wanna make a difference in your community, in the city? Share the gospel with a friend. Tell them about Jesus. Outside of our city, we also had mission trips throughout the summer in Guatemala, the Caribbean, and South Texas that involved construction projects, VBS, house visits, and more. Great seeds of faith were planted, and many kids and adults found new life in Christ. We finished strong with our Back to School Blast, where we saw our church family step up and serve our city with supplies for kids and teachers, medical exams, and more. Literally hundreds of backpacks were given out at Vickery and Cornerstone, and there was a great deal of excitement from the kids, families, and our volunteers. That brings us to today. We stand ready for a new school year, a fresh spirit, and great hope for the future. Join us tonight as Dr. Jeff Warren leads us in a critical time of prayer at 6 p.m. in the Great Hall. The summer is ending with our relaunch of the Journal Magazine. The Journal is our story as it unfolds while we follow Jesus every day. They are on campus today and also in the mail. It all begins as we welcome Jeff back. Let's be courageous, church.